everyone, Eva here, and thank you again for joining me uh, on this lovely Tuesday. It's not very lovely here. It's very gray and overcast and really makes me sad because I really love the sunshine, and when it's not shiny out, it really makes me sad. But anyway, <laughs> but I can't be sad today because we are going to... Um, Take a look at a new uh, palette that I got in the mail. Um, you can get it off Amazon, and I believe you can also get it off of Sephora. And uh, I believe just wherever you, I think Beauty Brand carries it, maybe. I'm not really positive. But just look for it. It's uh, Nude Rose. And it is by far one of the prettier palettes that I've gotten. Um, it's by BH Cosmetics. And I think the colors are lovely. I'm wearing them right now, and I don't know if you can really tell. But they're just, they're real, like, really well pigmented, but they're all really light shades, except for just a few of them. And I'll show you. I'm going to take this mirror out. Maybe not. Let's see if there's something I can use to cover it up. I probably should have been a little more prepared. It's not really how I roll. Ah, paper. Yay. I just don't really think you guys need to get blinded by my lights. Okay, so... It comes with this really nice brush, and like I said, the colors, they're all just, they're, they're really pretty. All the colors are really pretty, and like, this one is super pigmented. But, sorry, that's not showing up very well. There we go. Now I got a good color, good little sample. I mean, it's like super pigmented, and they're all a little, I mean, there are some matte ones, I don't know if you can tell, they're all a little, um, kind of iridescent, almost. Uh, there are a few matte, like I said, there's, um, this one's matte, and I believe this one's matte. Um, I think that's it. This one, that one's matte. But it comes with a nice little brush that says BH Cosmetics and a mirror. And it does come with a sheet that has um, that has the colors, but it doesn't actually say what the name of the color is, which I found kind of odd because I've never had a palette, I've never ordered a palette that has ever been without names of the colors so that was unusual um i don't know i mm, i don't know it, it it's it's odd to me it really is but i like them uh nudes are like very in i know that matte colors are very in as well but if you haven't noticed on most of my videos that I've done, um, my eyeshadow is all very, uh, how would you put it, iridescent. Um, not really glittery because, well, I'm not a teenage girl. And it's not the 90s, but it it's all kind of iridescent. Just because I really like how it makes my eyes sparkle. <laughs> you can't really tell now, but you know what I'm saying. It really makes my eyes sparkle, and I just, I really love my cameras causing the picture to change, like, tones. Oh, look at that. There it goes. Let's see if we can get it to do it again. Oh, there it goes again. I don't even know if you can see this when you're watching the video, but it's really freaky. Uh, 
<laughs> but that's my little video for today. Uh, BH Cosmetics, um, Nude Rose, and I think they're really pretty. Uh, are they probably one of the better that I've bought? No. Um, I think by far I love my... Uh, my hard candy palettes. Uh, they have like an uh, like a nude every day, and then they have even just a palette specifically for, you know, that big sexy smoky eye, which I think we should do, kind of a little video over how to properly do a smoky eye, because I kind of watched some. And I know that it's a tricky thing to do because everybody's eye shape's a little different. And, um, you know, for those of you who are not quite sure how to make it not look like super crazy, because once again, I mean, this is kind of my MO. This is everyday beauty. You know, I, I, I don't really... I'm not going to try and make anybody look like a runway model just because I don't think that that's every day. That's not natural and that's not, you know, what I like. You know, those of you who do like that, I'm totally fine with that because I think it can be really beautiful if you do it properly. But that's just not, you know, something that I do. And I have makeup all over my hand because apparently when I take a drink of my coffee, my lip color is coming off. See? <laughs> um, that is a MAC lip color. <laughs> so, I have Revlon and I don't think I've ever had that problem before. Just saying. Ew. Anyway, but, <laughs> oh, I'm going to get some crap for that one, I think. <laughs> Whatever, bring it on. Uh, <laughs> uh, I just, I really think that, you know, everyday beauty, you know, just everyday palettes, everyday eyes, everyday cheeks, everyday face, everyday lips, you know, are are just ultimately the most beautiful because you're not completely covering up who you are. You're you're letting your inner beauty shine through along with, you know, enhancing your external beauty. And that is definitely what I am here to talk about. You know, I mean, if there is something that you really do want to talk about that's not that Leave me a comment down below on anything that you want me to go over. I, I, I'm I, not saying I'm an expert, but I love makeup and I have tried a lot of different things. And I've tried doing a lot of different things to my face. So, I mean, if, if, you, if you want me to talk about how to make your lips look bigger, I've practiced a hundred times because if you can't tell... I don't have very big lips. My lips are kind of little, little baby lips. And if you want to talk about how to make your eyes look bigger, I, I've done that. I, I just necessarily, I don't feel that I need it because my eyes are already kind of bug eyes. But <laughs> I have a really big forehead. Um, <laughs> If you have a really big forehead and you want to know how to minimize it, I can show you. Now, right now, it actually worked. Sometimes it doesn't because sometimes it looks like I'm like this much forehead and this much face and it's just you to be, you know. But anyway, I'm getting weird, so definitely haven't had enough coffee this morning. Oh my gosh, so tired. I think it's the weather. The weather always makes me feel kind of blue when it's like this. Uh, when it's sad and dreary out, it makes me feel kind of sad and dreary. But thank you, Mr. Hurricane. Anyway, 
Um, well, that's it for me. Uh, we're harvesting right now, so I'm just kind of trying to fit what I can in and when I can. So if there is something that you'd like to talk about or if you just want to leave a comment and say, hey, you're crazy, I'm okay with that because I know I am. Anyway, <laughs> don't forget to subscribe and uh, leave comments down below. Uh, please subscribe, though, and become part of my crazy, weird, cuckoo, awesome family. Thank you, and hope to see you soon. Bye!